Hello everybody, another edition of Code and Chat with Zach. And today we're going to be looking at how to create a .bat file that will open a program for us. And in this case we're going to write a .bat file that will open the command line for us. And let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing you need is your command line open. Let's go ahead and type in notepad. Now you can use any text editor that you like. Uh, Notepad in this case works very well. Let's go ahead and go to File, Save. Now the first thing that you want to do is make sure that this Save as Type has been pulled down and all files, all files is required. Let's go ahead and save this on the desktop and let's call this Start underscore CMD dot BAT the dot bat is required and in order for that to work properly you do have to have the all files showing here so let's go ahead and save it and let's go to our notepad and let's type echo off this simply turns off the echo function or a print back function and next we will type start cmd.exe so we'll save that real fast and close it and notice we get this new icon right here. It has the large gear and the small gear, of course, with our name start CMD. So let's go ahead and close this. Now, when we double click that, we get a command line. It's really that simple. Some textbooks make it seem really complicated, but it is quite simple. But let's go ahead and show you how you can use a one bat file to open multiple programs. So let's go ahead and go back into notepad, open that up, and let's just go ahead and add start notepad.exe and we will save that quickly. Now we'll close this and notice when we run we get a CMD and a notepad. Hope that helps. Have a great day and keep coding.